But to me, when you gator roll, it creates a lot of space for them to defend. Okay? When I lock this up on call and like gator roll, all he has to do this whole time is keep his hands on my hips. Alright? So as we roll, he keeps his hands on my hips and walks. And I've got no way to defeat those hands except by using my hips and cramming over the top. And it's a lot of work. It's a lot of extra work in my opinion. Okay? If I can hit it quick and get a real good whip so he can't get his hands in, in place, it's going to be a little bit tighter. So instead, we're going to cheat a little bit. I lock up my, my arms here, and instead of diving my head under, I'm going to sit and do a pyramid to my right side. All right? Base, almost ba baseball slide my knee under to lever him over. Okay, so now my arms are in the opposite position. My arm, my, I'm laying on the arms that I have locked, okay? As opposed to when I gator rolled, I was laying on my other side. But by doing this, now I can hook that leg, and now again, I pull my right elbow backwards. To choke. Make sense? So instead of going all the way over, I'm coming underneath it. You're pulling the choking arm to the side of the head. Yep. So here, I lock. Sorry. Yep, yep. Ball, ball. Slide underneath. And walk. So now I'm helping push that arm across his neck. And I hook the leg. Hey, Ian, why not just do it that way every time? What's up? Uh, what's up? Uh, what you. Like, what would be the situation you use the first one? Where you gator roll? When I've got them extended. Because the first one's going to be on tighter. Okay, the first one's gonna be more likely to get that forearm into his neck, right underneath. <laughs> He's all stretched out. Okay? And really, it's whichever one you're more comfortable with. A lot of wrestlers, especially Greco guys, they're comfortable with that gator roll position. They've been doing it their whole lives. Okay? This type of position is gonna be more to get up underneath and lever into it. Because it gives me an option to get on top a little bit easier too, in my opinion. So it's just whatever works. Plan A, plan B. Okay. Cool? Questions? No. You need to see it or you Yeah. Hold on. Okay. And I just realized the first time I slid my legs to the wrong side, so sorry about that if it confused you. Alright, I pull on the elbow, punch my arm through, lock them up, step up on the outside, and I'm going to slide my knee underneath. Alright, same thing, I lock my hips, now his arms are trapped in between us, and I pull my elbow through. Got it? Well, yeah, because the yeah, first time you had your lock on the bottom. Right? Is that what you're saying? Yep. So, lock it up. Yep. Ball. Yep. No. Get your hand all the way up on his back. Almost. Get your hand all the way up on. There you go. All right, yep. So step up with your right foot. Slide your knee through. Yep. Sit your hip. Yep. And now hook his leg. Yep. And pull your left elbow back. Left. Yep. So the choking arm. Yep. There you go. Oh, sorry. All right. With your partners. One, two, three.